Hey guys, what's up? My name is Kendra. Welcome back to my channel. Today's video is going to be kind of a first impression, story time kind of a deal. Um, as you can tell from... Actually, am I going to put in the title? Am I going to put in the title? You know what? I am going to put in the title. So, as you know, I went to Dubai. You may know, you may not know. I went to Dubai, oh, like a week ago. Got home. And I got stuck in Hong Kong because I lost my passport. Mm -hmm. For like 10 extra hours, I was stuck in Hong Kong. But anyways, we'll get into that. Other part of today's video is a first impressions. Do you see that? Do you see that? Do you see that? Ooh. Right there. Right there. KDW Beauty and Mario did the Artist and the Muse collection. So very excited about this. We have a, a lip liner. We have a, a blush, which I did my base already, but we'll we'll look at it. It's fine. Then we have um, a lipstick. I'm assuming this is a lip gloss. A gloss. And da -da -da -da, an eyeshadow palette. Which, ooh, that packaging though. That's really cute. I enjoy that. And is that all we have? That is. That is all we have. So we are gonna look at these real quick. Hopefully we don't have a repeat of what happened with the So Fire palette. Hope and pray. Ooh, just the plastic. Yay! Nothing's falling out. Nothing's falling out guys. We're good. We're good. This is super pretty. Ooh. Mario's Muse. Do we see that color? <gasps> Oh, that's pretty. That is. Yep, I like this. I like it a lot. Okay, so we're gonna play with that. It's weird when some of them have like weird textures and you're like, is there something there? Is there? Also, Emma, if you're watching, ASMR. Okay. Moving on to the flush. Okay, complaint about KKW packaging. The first time you open these components, why am I not in focus? Thank you. Uh, the first time you open these components, it is handy to have some sort of knife. Just to pop it open. Especially when you have big nails. Oh, that's a really pretty color. Actually, I use like a metallic version of like this shade. It's kind of peachy, really pretty. Like it, I will definitely use that at a later time. And now moving on to lipstick. This is called He's a Mixer. And it is definitely, hmm, I don't really, hmm. it's not really my kind of shade. It's pretty though, we'll try it. Definitely try it. Now the lip liner is called Beauty Icon, which I mean, it's pretty safe to say their beauty icons. This, oh, that's really pretty. It's like a dark, darkish brown. Yeah, I like that. Definitely looking forward to using that. And the gloss is called Proud of You. Aw, that's cute. 
And it is, yeah, just a nude. Give it a little swatch. Yeah, that's what you would expect from this collection, for sure. Okay. So, my base is already done, so we're just gonna dive right in to the palette. Could you imagine if that was the palette? Oh my goodness. I would die. I would actually die. <laughs> but it's not, it's fine, it's fine, we're fine, we're good. Okay, so we are gonna jump right into this palette. And you know what? We are going to take, oh, what are we gonna take? You know what? We're gonna take Don't Move, which is kind of like a transition color right here. And we're gonna take it on a Morphe 573 brush. Just gonna pick that up. One thing I do like, about the KKW eyeshadows is when you go into the palette, there isn't much fallout. Like you can see a little bit, but it stays in the pan. It's nothing crazy. It's really, it's good. I enjoy it. So, shall we talk about trip to Dubai? I think we should. Yeah, so all in all, it was a really good trip. It uh, definitely a crazy place. Um, it is over the top. And a lot of the things that are over the top, it's just like they're taking things that everyone else has done, like the fountain show, um, and just amping it up by a hundred, I think. It basically makes Vegas look like child's play. Which was actually, it was really cool to see. It was really pretty. We went to the top of the Burj Khalifa, which again was, it was like, oh, it, it was an experience. We're just gonna take Mario's Muse and put it all over. We're just gonna take a little bit more. There we go. Yeah, that's pretty. Now, on the way back is when things got interesting. So we had the opportunity to upgrade our flight from Dubai to Hong Kong and to be in business class, which, why not? If you had an opportunity to do so, why wouldn't you? And so we had a seven and a half, almost eight hour flight from Dubai to Hong Kong on the way home. And, <coughs> excuse me. I have a travel wallet that I have our passports in, our tickets in, keeps everything really organized. And when I had gone on the flight, I thought I had put my passport back in there. I didn't. And there was like a little cubby, like right beside the seat. And so I put my wallet in there, put like everything in there that I was holding on to. And then of course after the flight, um, we were leaving the plane and I grabbed my wallet and I thought everything was in there, but it wasn't. Cut to four hours later, but we're getting to board our next flight and I cannot find my wallet anywhere. Anywhere. And so I go up to the desk and I tell them I have lost my passport. I have no idea where it is. It is the plane that I was on just by chance is it still here? Nope, that plane is on its way to Taiwan. 
Hero, we made the decision that Ian would take the flight that we were scheduled on home and I would basically have to wait until they got in contact with passport office to see if they would allow me to travel home with just my ID. So it was definitely, it was super stressful. Um, and a really crappy way to end such a cool trip. But I mean, it happens. So moral of the story is don't upgrade to business. It's not worth it. Nope, mm-mm, not worth it. <sighs> we're just gonna keep it super simple and we're gonna do some Anxious Angel lashes from Likely Makeup. Okay, I'm gonna go put these on and I will be right back. So we're gonna take the lip liner that came with it in the shade Beauty Icon. And then with the lipstick. Okay, this is definitely dry. Like, really dry. I don't. I'm not a big fan of dry lips, like stick lipsticks. So this definitely needs needs the gloss. Okay, so this is the final look of using the Artist and Muse palette from KKW Beauty in collaboration with Mario and I'm very happy that none of the shadows fell out. Very happy about that. Um, yeah, I mean, I like the palette. I mean, they always do really nice palettes. Um, I like the gloss. I don't like the lipstick, it's so dry. It is really, really dry. Um, yeah, like it's, it's there. It's a thing that happened. It's not a thing that I would get. Um, and I mean, the lip liner is really pretty. I think this with a different lipstick is gonna be really pretty. But yeah, I mean, if you are gonna get anything, I would get, I guess, the eyeshadow palette. Oh, and I didn't try the blush today, but I mean, her blushes are always really pretty. I don't really like the color. Um, yeah, I wouldn't bother getting the lipstick. It's there, it's there. It's part of the collection. Um, but yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. Please like this video because, you know, I'm back home and not stuck in Hong Kong with all the things going on there. And comment down below telling me if you could go anywhere, where would you go? And yeah, also, I'm planning on doing something special once I get to a thousand. So help me get to a thousand quicker by hitting that subscribe button. And yeah, I will see you guys on the next video. Bye.